According to the farmers, rain was expected in November. They claimed the crops they planted early last year got burned by the sun due to inadequate rain and now they are replanting. Despite the delay, the farmers are not demoralized but are rather hopeful for a great harvest. We spoke to some subsistent farmers. Some may say the rain came early, others will say it is delayed, but all I can say, God had mercy on us this year. Last year we tried but we did not harvest well, but this year I believe it is going to be different. Let's not be discouraged, but even those who did not do anything yet should not think it's January now we are late. Let's just put in efforts. Rain is here. This year it started like it was going to rain when we started planting. We walked with holes in this field and it started germinating. Then the sun came and burned everything. As you can see we are replanting because the rain is here and we are motivated even on land that we did not clear last time. Years back we did not harvest anything. The previous year we at least got something. But last year we went back to bad harvest. But we are hopeful this year that's where we are putting in efforts. I think this year we are going to have a great harvest. During the NBC News team's visit to the crop fields, some farmers were found using oxen for plowing, others hoes, with more fortunate ones using tractors. Chairperson of the Kavango West Farmers Union, Johannes Ausiku, says he is happy with the efforts being put in by the subsistent farmers. He says despite majority using hoos due to a lack of livestock, people are focused on the outcome. What I really experience, the rains, we are receiving a good rain, and if the farmer continue plowing, I think the production for this year can be good. Yeah, I see all the areas that I went or I visited, I see the people are busy plowing. And also you find those who started maybe early November, you can see already the crop already started. I think and I hopeful that this year can be different if the rain can continue like this. Alsiku calls on those that haven't started to put in more effort as the rain looks promising. He further urged farmers to share their seeds with those that do not have anything at all. Elizabeth Mwengo, NBC News, Kurenkuru.